Huge thank you to today's sponsor, Squarespace. More about them later. It's the most wonderful time of the year. Today is the best amps of 2023. Yay! So sit down, maybe buy yourself a Christmas present with a cheap Audio Man mug. Let's talk about the best amps of 2023. So the amp of the year is just not amps of the year because that would be pretty boring because most people don't even know what a power amp is. Amp of the year is going to be anything that you hook up speakers to. Some of them may have internal DACs. Some of them may have internal phono preamps. Some of them may have streamers. Anything that you hook up a speaker to, we're going to talk about today and what I think is the best products that I've heard this year, by the way, thank you so much for watching and please have a safe, happy holiday season. Love each other, be nice. You ever wanna start your own website? Well, now's the best time in the world to do it because Squarespace makes it so easy. I've created three websites off of Squarespace, one of which I came up with idea and the website was online in about two, three hours. The only thing that you have to do is answer a few questions about yourself or your business, and then drag and drop your own photos, double click on the text boxes and fill out your information or information about your business. Are you a needle nose plier aficionado? And check out and see if needle nose pliers aficionado.com is available or .net or .co or .org. If you have a business, you can start selling things online like digital products, like tangible products, like this towel that's covered in zero sugar cola because I spilled it on my mouse pad. And if you don't know how to do something, don't worry. Squarespace has a great help center. You just type in what you want to do. Email campaigns, sell stuff online. It doesn't matter. Squarespace has a whole bunch of articles and videos to help you integrate it into your brand new website. So run on over to squarespace.com slash cheap audio man. Use the code cheap audio man to get 10% off your first order, domain reservation, whatever it is you want to do with Squarespace. It's never been easier to start your own website, even if you don't have a business. Start your own family website. Put your pictures on there. Then mom and grandma can download full res images and then run on over to Walgreens or CVS and print them out. They don't look terrible. So run on over to squarespace.com slash cheap audio man. Use the code cheap audio man to get 10% off your first domain order or order of other products. Thank you, Squarespace. And the winner for affordable all in one little amplifier goes to Yaima T9 Pro. Winner. Yay! Yaima T9. I think won it the year before, two years before. Anyway, this is a great, awesome value. You get a fully functioning DAC inside, enough power to drive most speakers, and tubes. Just kidding, I don't really like tubes, but it comes with tubes if you want to use them and roll them. It has Bluetooth, USB, coaxial, optical in, RCA and I would show it to you right now if I hadn't given it away. I've been cleaning out the cheap audio man cache of hi-fi equipment, sending it out to needy people all over the world. Anyway, it's great. Even comes with a remote control. So it's $150, 10% off coupon on Amazon right now. So that puts it at $135. Actually it says on Amazon, frequently returned item. I don't know if that's any good. Let's try this again. And the winner for the all-in-one affordable amplifier goes to SMSL AL200. Winner! Yay! This has an Infineon chip, which just sounds amazing. It's got some baked-in EQs as well. Optical in, USB in, coaxial in, RCA in. The DAC has MQA decoding made out of aluminum. I would show this one to you too, but I also gave this one away. Built really well, significantly better than the IEMA T9. Cool little form factor, sleek even. And best of all, no tubes on the top. It says it puts out 165 watts of power. I 
Just assume it puts out 40 or 50 watts. Comes with a remote control and a headphone amp. Super solid, $233. Switching it up a little bit, the amp of the year for the more expensive all-in-one integrated goes to, I know you can't see it right here, the wonderful Rotel A11 Mark II. Winner! Yay! Comes with a DAC, comes with one of the best sounding phono stages that I've ever heard in an integrated amp. This phono stage is so good that I would probably get rid of my reference two box S2 because you don't need it anymore. This is a $500 phono stage. The A11 Mark II I think comes in around seven or $800. It's like getting a really good amp and DAC for 300 bucks. Very conservatively rated at 50 watts times two in the eight ohms. I talked to him, I think it puts out 60 watts times two in the four ohms, but those are very conservative numbers. These will get most speakers rocking and rolling as loud as you could possibly stand it. Class AB amplification comes with Bluetooth. If you really want to use that. You got four RCA inputs, one optical, one coaxial. So you can take a Weem Pro, connect it right into the A11 Mark II and have great streaming for $150. Now you have an all-in-one package for less than a thousand dollars. Also has a headphone output. Kind of old school meets new school. Now, if you don't want the DAC, they do have the A10 Mark II, and that comes in at $200 cheaper. Basically the same thing without the DAC. So if you already have a killer DAC, check out the A10 Mark II. Super clean sounding, big soundstage, amazing product. I can't recommend it enough. I love the Rotel A11 Mark II. The affordable versatile amp of the year. You guessed it. I just did a review on it yesterday. Fozzy Audio ZA3. Winner. Yay! Amazing versatile little product. Has balanced inputs on the back, RCA inputs. You can run this in mono, which means you get more power so you can buy one of these, save up some money, buy another one later. Now you have two mono amplifiers, tons of power, even in stereo mode. You can get a 32 volt or a 48 amp volt, five amp, sorry, power supply, boost up the power. But we're also going to give an honorable mention to the IEMA A07 Max. This is a smaller amplifier, does... Pretty much the same thing. Same amp chip inside, which is the Texas Instruments 3255. Short on space, get the IEMA A07 Max. I do think the Fozzy Audio sounds better, but I haven't heard the A07 Max running in mono with two of them going at the same time. Both very affordable. I think the ZA3 comes in around $150. A07 Max comes in a little bit less, but guess what? They're both kind of sold out on Amazon right now because they're so popular. Actually, the A07 Max is back in stock on Amazon for $91.99. And it's got a 10% off coupon. So it's like 80 something dollars. They also both have swappable op amps, which means you can upgrade the sound to your taste. They're built on the backs of American, Japanese, and German components. And if anybody thinks these are crap and you put it in the comments, please give an alternative at the same price, maybe even 25, 35% more. I'm all ears, I want to hear. Don't just say this is crap. Contribute to the community and tell us what we should buy instead. And the amplifier of the year is the Weem amp. Winner! Yay! Absolutely amazing. $300. Beautiful. Aluminum construction. On the back, you have an optical input, a coaxial input, a subwoofer output with high and low pass filtration. So bass management inside the app. If you don't know about the Weem streaming platform, it's amazing. And it's really disrupted that huge hi-fi streaming industry. In all seriousness though, this uses the Texas Instruments 3255 amp chipset as an internal power supply. So you don't have to worry about big power supply bricks that you put on something like a printer and your lights dim when you go print out something. Also has HDMI arc. So this thing 
you can put right next to your TV, put two speakers and a sub on it. You got a great 2.1 channel system. You have all the streaming you want. Honestly, there's an entire video just dedicated to Ween products that you have to check out because this platform is amazing. Frankly, it's like getting a free amplifier with bass management because even if it was a streamer, $299 is worth the price of admission alone. The amount of stuff this thing can do and how well it does it is simply amazing at $299. Other competitors can't even touch it at twice the price and they don't have the Ween platform. So that's it. If I missed something, put it in the comments, please. Is there a product that I left out? Let me know. I'm not perfect. I don't do a lot of research for these videos. Congratulations to all the winners and the illustrious Cheap Audio Man Amplifier Awards for 2023. There will be no trophies, no seals of approval sent out, just this video. If you made it this far and you're not subscribed, why not? Subscribe to the Cheap Audio Man channel and give this video a like if you found it at all informative, entertaining, or valuable. I hope everybody has a great holiday. Please be safe out there and please be grateful for everything you have because if you're watching this video, chances are you have extra money to spend on hi-fi equipment and your own enjoyment. There are other people out there that are much less fortunate than we are, so we should be grateful. So don't binge watch anything on Netflix or Hulu. Buy yourself one of these awesome pieces of amplification equipment and fill your soul with happiness. And with that, I'm Randy. I'm the Cheap Audio Man.